Hello again, I've uh, tweaked the uh, code a little bit and made a new sensor for the proximity sensor. As you can see, it's a um, got a piece of aluminum mesh which is sandwiched between two eighth inch thick pieces of plexiglass and I have that same um, mesh material kind of wrapped around the perimeter which attached the ground to kind of help cancel out noise slightly. Well, anyway, since the um, this you know, ground mesh is perpendicular to the sensor plate mesh, the added capacitance really is not very much at all, so it still leaves extra room for me to add capacitance with my hand when I get close to it. So let's turn it on and see if it works. All right. It's calibrating, it'll blink three times, let us know that it's done. There it goes. Oh, it seems like it's you just reset it and let it go through it again. Okay, so right now the LED is totally off. So, well, for the most part, kind of blinks a few times, but see around six inches away, it starts sensing. The closer you get, the brighter it gets. Let me turn the slide off. Another cool thing. It's, um, you know, it really doesn't have to be, it can be really be anything that has mass that can affect the dielectric constant of the environment around it, like a coffee mug for instance. Well, what's nice about the code is that it can, you know, you reset it, it'll start adapting. It'll adapt to its environment and use that as the uh, new reference. I'll try it again. Obviously, I have more work to do, but it's close. Anyway, so the coffee mug is empty. We're going to add water to it. Kind of show you what happens. It's kind of neat. The more we fill it up, the brighter it gets because the more you know, mass there is to affect the dielectric constant. Which is pretty much the only reason why this works. Alright, thanks for watching. Keep watching for updates, I suppose.